Smart Cat Profile Properties. We are looking today at a ninth floor unit at the Solaris Towers in Pitt Meadows. I'm just cleaning the side of the building today, but I'm standing outside on Ford Road. This is the Jolly Coachman. And this is the tower. The library is to the left. There's a waves in there. And it's a 10-story building. Our unit is actually right there. You can see the large balcony. So it's the ninth floor unit, second from the top. And you can see that the balcony is double the size of most in the building. Only about four of them, I think, in the two towers. And you can see we're on the ninth floor. That's the den on the left side, which is all glass. You'll see that in a minute. So we're just coming into the front lobby at the Solaris Towers. Got the mail room around the corner here. There's no fitness room or amenity room in this building. And we're gonna head towards the elevator. So we are on the floor, on the ninth floor. Elevators are here. There's buildings been freshened up with new carpets just put in recently. This is a 2010 building. And this is our suite. So really nice that you don't just come straight in to the living area. But instead, because it's a corner unit, you're going to go around the corner first. And uh, this is the living room kitchen area. So it's just one open space. And the living room, all glass, an electric fireplace on that wall. And off in the corner, that is a den. So this is about as best an office that you could have on the northeast corner of the building. It's a lot better than most dens where it might feel a little bit like a dungeon. These days, working, everybody working from home. The views from here are pretty amazing. These are really the best views in the building. On the north side is definitely my favorite side. A little bit on the louder side on this because we have Harris Road and Ford below. If it was a better day, we could see the Golden Ears, the mountains around Pitt Lake. You can't quite make them out today, but you've actually got views all the way around to the east, out the den and the second bedroom face east. We're facing north. On a better day, you would see above Burke Mountain, above the trees, sorry, towards Burke Mountain. And to the west. You can actually see all the way to the Portman Bridge, Burnaby Mountain, and towards Westwood Plateau. So at night, the whole Westwood Plateau lights up. Really nice views at night. Let's do a little zoom. That's the Coast Meridian Overpass at the bottom. Westwood Plateau, and then we're looking towards Coquitlam. That would be Mundy Park. The door just hit my arm. And then looking towards, all the way towards Burnaby, Burnaby Mountain, but then that is Portman Bridge and Edmonds area, of uh, Edmonds Station area of Burnaby. Mostly, this is a mountain view towards the north. I do have tenants on the south and west side that complain about the heat, and a lot of them use air conditioning units. But the north side, you're not going to have that problem. It's definitely the cool side of the building. Let's head back inside. So the electric fireplace. And this floor was replaced two to three years ago. And the paint, the wall paint is brand new, as well as brand new carpets in the bedroom. 
So we're gonna take a look at the kitchen. A little bit of dents in the stainless. We are a 10 year old building. So a little bit of wear there. Newer microwave. But we have a lot of cabinet space. Large island in the middle. Okay, let's have a look in this den. I guess we can look at it right through the glass. So it's got a glass door and it's all glass. So I think if you're working from home, this is a huge selling feature. The views are really good from here. You've got exposure to the north side towards Pit Lake and the mountains there. And then we've got the east side. Looking towards Maple Ridge. It's actually larger than a lot of the dens in this building. It's not huge, but no question space for any desk. We're gonna have a look at the second bedroom now. So we're facing east. These are brand new carpets just installed yesterday. So we've got the privacy blinds but we also had installed in the two bedrooms in this one uh, the secondary blinds which are actually dark in it. Tenant here had a baby and so that was what they needed. So the views from the second bedroom towards the east and a single closet and fresh paint. So we've got different colors. This is the gray in the bedroom and we're going to take a walk to the master again the brand new carpets the different color from living room towards the master master bedroom be tough to get a king in here I would say should work and again the views so we've got east and north on the other side this one actually does have a peak towards the west even so there's a bit of a wraparound window that faces west and just to show you what's below that's 190A and we are on Ford Road directly below it's a Jolly Coachman pub there. And we're just about four or five blocks from Low Heat. So you can see the deck there and this is the master bedroom. Closets. We've got two closets. Some shelves inside. We're going to head towards the ensuite. So, the single sink. And these units have a stand up shower with the rain wand, and then it's also got the deep tub. Just had contractors in doing the paint and carpets, so a little dusty. We will need to do a cleaning. That'll be done the next few days. And we're going to head over here. We've got one parking stall downstairs. There's a good sized storage locker. Back towards the front. So not just a storage locker, you also have this storage room inside the unit. This is a pretty good bonus. This is really adds a lot of storage and more secure than any locker of course. And then we're going to look at the main bathroom. 
So new paint in here. We have a tub with tiles and another rain wand shower. Faucet. Single sink. Placed a few years ago. Whirlpool stacker. And so, if you are interested in this property, please call 604 464 7548. And this is Mark at Profile Properties.